Well, hello everyone. This is gonna be something a little bit different, but I think you guys will really enjoy this. So, have you ever heard of a game called 20 Questions? I, I know I'm holding up only like two fingers, but what do you want me to do, this? Because that looks dumb, it should be like this, you know? So anyway, so 20 Questions is a game where you think of something, an animal, a person, an object, and you, your friend, or whoever else, it could be one or more people that try to challenge you into figuring out what exactly you are thinking about in just 20 questions or less. So then there came this little game that was on the internet called Akinator. You may have heard of this. Basically, it's a genie that will try to guess what you are thinking of in 20 questions or less. And mostly it was just like celebrities and uh, YouTubers and whoever. Well, now they have a phone app version of this game. Well, I say now, it's probably been out for a while. I just don't, never really paid attention. Probably because I was in uh, uh, China, you know, I was in China. Let's go ahead and load up this app. And there's a section here. He is going to guess what animal I'm thinking of. You know, gotta make this furry related somehow. What I have right here on this tablet is all the info and pictures of said animal that I'm going to be thinking of. So you have about seven or eight pulled up. And this first one should be pretty easy. We'll just use it as a test run. Just to show you guys how this guy works. All right, so first question says, does your animal have paws? The animal I'm thinking does not, but still exists. This will consider animals that are extinct which means dinosaurs and um, the white albino rhinoceri going extinct, nearly extinct about a decade ago and then were killed by all the poachers. Uh, Cause people are bastards. But yes, this one does exist, thankfully. Uh, walks on four legs, yes. Uh, is this raised on a farm? I don't see how you could. By the way, if you can guess what animal I'm thinking of before the genie does, Props to you. Let's make this a little game. Play at home if you want. Keep score and figure out how long until you figure out what I'm thinking of. So anyway, taller than a man? Definitely. Uh, has it got spots? Yes, it does. Uh, large spots. I guess, I guess they're large, yeah. I guess it's got a yellowish skin. We're well, not skin, fur. Uh, yes. So, it was a giraffe. Right, and they give out awards for, and points for how uncommon the animal is that it guesses. Basically, it's almost like you're working with the genie to get up a, um, as much points as it can to find the most uncommon animal you can both think of and figure out. I should mention this isn't the first time I try to record this, but uh, my footage got a little bit mishandled. Um, not gonna go into detail about that. Let's try this other animal. Go ahead and scratch giraffe off the list here. All right, next animal. You know what, let's do something different, actually. Uh, I'm not gonna do that one. I'm gonna do something different. Does it eat other animals? No, it, I mean, it shouldn't. Is it generally yellow? I would love to see that, but no. <laughs> Raised in a farm, no. Four legs, yes. Zebra striped. I kind of, this is the second time that zebra striped has showed up so far. I'm kind of wondering if like, there are multiple species that are zebra striped. That, that's just strange. Um, no. Who's, yes, humps. Uh, no, antlers, uh, yes. Does it live in Africa? Well, um, yes it does. Does it have a long neck? It's not another giraffe. Blathering idiot. Now, is it known by everybody? I don't think so. I would just say don't know. Is it thin? Nope. Has it got stripes? Yes, it does. And curved horns. Uh. Oh, does it? No, 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 they're straight. Does it like hot places? I don't know, some like it hot. A little weird? Aren't we all a little weird? I mean, really? Aren't we all just a tiny bit unique and weird in our own ways? I mean, just look at me, just just look. I'm talking to you right now with an animal head on, playing a quiz game about animals. I'm, we're all, and you're watching. So clearly we're in the same boat. I I'm sorry about getting all preachy like that. Uh, no. In a zoo, actually. And no, it's not rare. Black and white, 
the stripes are, I, maybe the stripes are a little bit black and white. I don't remember. Stripes on its tail? No, the, no, no, no. Is it kind? I wasn't prepared for this kind of like moral judgment on my animal. Is it kind? Does it give to charity? D does it vote Republican? I had to... <laughs> Why am I supposed to judge that? I don't know. Is it orange? Yes. Okay. Loves water. Probably. Uh... Wait, is that? Oh my god, I forgot what it was called. I tried to go against my own system. Tried to do something a little bit different and... And, I... and here I am. Confused about whether... This is the right animal or not. Why do I do this? Ah, uh, stick to the plan. I'll just say yes. Ooh, I got a silver for that. Let's see what other animal I can pull up here. I'm gonna go with this one right here. All right, so I think a good amount of these don't actually have paws that I pulled up here. No, it's not biased, I swear. Four legs, yes it does. Hooves, yes. Still exists, yes. Raised on a farm. Uh, it's domesticated. I don't know if it's on a farm. Horseback riding. I don't think you could do that with this. <laughs> it does have horns, yes. Uh, do you use the milk of your animal? You can milk it, but it's not common. Hey, look, that's, that's not fair. That's not a fair question to ask. Hey, that's shaming, okay? Come on. Well, it has horns. It doesn't have antlers. Uh, more than 200 pounds, definitely. I'm not gonna answer if it's fat. I, I know for a fact that it's more than 200 pounds. That's, that's the difference between scientific fact and like body shaming, you know? Live in Asia, yes it does. Live in the snow, yes. Used to carry things, I think it's getting close. So does it swim? Probably not. Long hair, yes. Can you ride your animal? Wait a minute. Because it doesn't, it's, I'm on the Wikipedia page, and it doesn't say if people ride them or not. Uh, larger than a house. No, not really. Nails? Does it count as nails? No, I don't know. Yep, it's a yak. By the way, Yona is best yak. She is indeed. And that's a silver for 400. Find another animal. Does not have paws. It has, it does exist. But it doesn't have four legs. Probably has more. Does it stand on two legs? It doesn't. Live in the water, yes. Heavy. No, you can lift it up. Fins? It does not have fins. Uh, it does have legs. Lives in the sea. So it doesn't live in the sea. It just lives in the, the muddy sand coastal area. Microscopic? No. Does it swim? I'd say so. Hard body, yes. Known by everybody. See, that's hard to judge. Because you probably know what this is, but I... You probably don't either. And that's just not you watching the video. That's everybody. Good to eat? <sighs> that's a good question. I don't think everyone's tried to eat this. Not that I've known. More than four legs? Yes. Can it be dangerous? I don't think so. Pincers? Eh, no. Can it be put on a finger if you try hard enough? <laughs> no. <laughs> it's got a shell, yes. Bigger than your foot? Yes. A long tail? Yeah, it does. It does. Done in different colors? I'd say so. And long legs? Nope. Is it white? I... I I'm not gonna make any racial judgments here. Is that elongated? I don't think it's very elongated. Antenna? I don't think so. Green? No. There it is. It's the horseshoe crab. See, I, I don't just do hooved things. I don't do just animals with hooves on them. That would be ridiculous. Uh, 100. I was hoping for better. Like, I'm not trying to do anything too rare, otherwise this is not gonna get it, and I'm not gonna get any points. So, uh, let's try this one. Found in houses. It, it could sneak in, I guess. I don't know. Four legs, yes. Your animal a pet. Anything could be a pet, dude. <laughs> Just not normally. Larger than a man. It's about, wait, taller. Uh, lengthwise, maybe? Still exists, yes. Raised in a farm? No, no. Is it got hooves? No. Live in the water? It can live around water. It is a reptile and it has legs. Heavy? Probably. Scary? Maybe. <laughs> what does this thing eat? Hold on. It doesn't want to light up when I pick it up. Okay. 
Okay, so this is an eat, a meat eater, and it's kind of big, so I'm gonna say probably not primarily insects. Warm countries, yes. Camouflage, wait, can it? Hold on, that'd be really cool if it did. <laughs> I'm gonna say probably not. Oh God, does your animal live in the human body? I hope not. No. Used for hurting? God, I wish. <laughs> oh my God, no. A why would you herd with a reptile? In a cage sometimes. If it's at a zoo, maybe? Uh, eats plants, no. What is it? Ah, it's close. Monitor lizard? It's a little bit bigger than that. Ah, uh, we have already passed the, the 20 questions part, so let's try again. We can keep continuing. Let's see how far this gets. Live in a lake? No. Claws? Yes. Poisonous? Don't know. Ferocious? I... Yeah, sure. Endangered? Hold on. Okay. Conservation status says vulnerable, which is not endangered. More than 20 pounds? Oh, yes, it does. Longer than a bus? And it's still alive? Oh, my God, no. There it is. Komodo dragon. I think I may have saw one when I was in Indonesia, actually. Like, not as big as this thing, but, like, it was a... A, a definite lizard that walked around and was by one of the temples. No, wait, that was Thailand. Not, not Indonesia, Thailand. What lizard was that anyway? No. These primarily live in Indonesia and the Borneo Island. What, what lizard am I thinking of? Anyway, yes. It has to be on his first guess to earn any points at all. All right, this is gonna be the last one. I think I tried to do this last time I mess around with this game. This is the most rare thing I can think of. Apparently, so let's see if we can get it this time. So it has paws. Uh, found in the houses? Probably not. Eat other animals? God no. Uh, is a pet? It's not really. Live in trees? It actually does. Yes. Uh, live in a zoo? Probably does. Actually. Um, really slow? No. Known by everybody? Probably not. Unless you like coffee. Yeah, that's a big hint right there. Kept in a pocket? No. Stripes on its tail. I know what animal that is, but it's not this one. Climb trees, it does. Is it brown? Yes. Nocturnal? It is, yeah. Uh, large eyes? No. Fly? No. Is it gray? You just asked if it was brown, so no. Bushy-tailed? Not that bushy. Low? No. Live in South America? Oh, no. Uh, eat plants? Yeah. Is red? All over? No. Black? Probably not. Uh, does it squeak? I, that would be cute, but no. Uh, found in Australia. No. Is it soft? Oh, yes. I petted one. It is soft. Uh, found in the jungle. Yes. Fluffy ears. Uh, it's a little bit, but I don't know. Can we put on a finger? Uh, I can't. I, I know what it's saying, but I'm just... The mental image. Fluffy? Yes. Let's see what it thinks. A bush baby? It's way too small. Uh, let's see if we can keep going. Does it run fast? Uh, probably. Ferocious? Probably not. South America? No. It's not rare. It's just in one specific area. It's, it's not really rare. Um, by specific area, I mean just a general region in Asia. Oh, 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 you'll see what I mean. Uh, many types of your animal? Not really. France? No. A kinkachu? It's not a kinkajou. Let's keep going. To live in Australia. It's not Australia, it's in Asia. Africa, no. Long nose, no. Really fast, don't know. Creepy, hey, don't be rude. It's definitely no. Bamboo leaves, no, no. Europe, no. Thumbs, don't know. Long tail, yes. Does it kill chickens? Oh God. Is it an ice age? God, there's like five of those, by the way. There are five ice age movies. Can you believe that? I don't know if it's an ice age. Long body, it's kind of long. Can it glide? It can climb on your shoulders, but no. More than 20 pounds? Didn't feel like it. Asia, yes. Legs, yes. Burrow, no. Green, probably. Hands, no. From China. Not really. Feline? Yeah, kind of feline. Is it now? No. 
Oh, there it is. The third one, Asian palm civet, which is where the poop coffee comes from. Oh, I gotta talk about the poop coffee pretty soon. The, well, the other name for the poop coffee is called Kopi Luwak, or Luwak coffee. It's better than last time. It took like four or five proposals before I actually got it right. Yeah, so that was interesting. I hope you guys liked that video. Uh, I'll have to see if I can try this with uh, another friend of mine. Uh, I know some of them that work with animals, so I'm interested to see what they think of. So this has been Lightning Runner. Uh, it's kind of late right now. It's past one. It's past 1:30 a.m. and I should be in bed right now. But I decided to film tonight. <sighs> I hope I'm not too loud. But it's all good because we got some content today. Well, tonight. So. I'll see you in the next video. It'll probably be that, be that uh, How Furry review that I was trying to release last week or so. Learn some more about your animals and if they're endangered or not. Give back to some animal related charities if you can. That's pretty helpful. Not PETA though. Don't, don't trust the PETAs. I'm a little suspicious on the Humane Society too. Just, just a feeling. And I'll see you guys in the next video. A whoosh.